Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll show you an example of how to set up Modbus RTU communication on a SunGrow logger and test it using Modbus Poll. In this case, I'll be polling data through the COM2 port, A2B2 of the logger. So, I need to configure Modbus forwarding to COM2. Under Modbus RTU, I'll set the serial port forwarding to COM2. Set the delay time to 200 milliseconds and then save the settings. Once the serial port is configured, I'll take note of the COM2 RS485 serial port settings, board rate, parity bit and stop bit. These are default values and I'll use them later when setting up the connection in Modbus Poll. Let's try to poll the data now. Step 1. Log in to your logger. and click Device Monitoring. Under Real-Time Values, I'll be polling the phase A, B and C voltages of the inverter. Step 2. Open Modbus Poll and set up the connection. Go to Connection, Connect. The Connection Setup window will appear. Select Serial Port, choose the COM port that matches your USB RS485 adapter as detected by your computer. Set the board rate, parity and stop bit to match the values we recorded earlier. Click OK. Next, go to Setup, Read Write Definition. For Slave ID, enter 1. You can verify this in the logger under Address for Modbus Forwarding. Function, select 04, read input registers, 3x. Now, let's check the register addresses for phase A, B and C voltages from the Modbus protocol document. The register address for phase A voltage is 5019. In Modbus poll, you need to subtract 1, so enter 5018. Set the quantity to 3, so we can read phase A, B and C at the same time. Set data type to U16 and display to unsigned. Then click apply. That's it. You can now compare the real-time voltage shown in the logger with the values read in Modbus Poll. Reminder, the values in Modbus Poll need to be multiplied by 0.1 to get the actual voltage. And that's it. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more SunGrow tips and solar troubleshooting videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.